Now, today's top stories and Power of 5 weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Good morning, I'm Danita Harris. And I'm Katie Houston. We have a look at your top local stories on your Monday. This morning, we do expect a verdict in a case involving a Cleveland police officer. Officer Matt Peter has pleaded not guilty to rape and gross sexual imposition. He's accused of sexually assaulting a woman at his home last year. He has been suspended without pay. The judge is expected to announce a verdict at 930 this morning. We'll have it for you both on air and online. Jury trials will start again today in Cuyahoga County Common Pleas Court. The judge voted to postpone them more than a month ago because of the surge in COVID cases. But right now, they're only going to hear cases where the defendant is currently in jail because they say they've been especially impacted by the pandemic, and that will last until March 18th. You now have a little longer to take advantage of the Ashtabula Municipal Court's new fines and court cost payment program. It was supposed to end last Friday, but it's been extended to this Friday now. With this program, the court will match your $100 minimum payment by doubling it. This includes fees from 2020 and earlier. First Energy has two months to decide how it will refund customers for the millions of dollars it used to lobby for the nuclear bailout bill, federal regulators say, and proper accounting led to power customers being overcharged. And today, tickets go on sale for the MAC tournament. The Mid-American Conference tourney will be at Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse March 9th through the 12th. The winning team gets an automatic bid to the NCAA tournament. Both men's and women's teams are competing. All right, let's get a look at your Monday forecast now. Ooh, we're almost getting into March Madness time. We're at the beginning of February. Let's go. We've got 20s outside feeling very February like today. Yes, it will be a bit cloudier than it was yesterday and over the weekend, but at least we're still seasonable. At least we're still hanging on to about 35, 36. Average this time of year is 37. Now this evening, numbers cool off quickly. We've got more clouds and I got a couple snow showers to talk about now. I'll track those out for you coming up. Plus, we'll let you know how much we can expect by early Tuesday morning. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.